Hi guys and welcome to my newest tutorial. In today's video we're gonna talk about how you can basically add or not add but change font on your website on WordPress. So how do we start doing that basically? We are going to start by going to plugins. So this is our dashboard right here. On the left hand side we're gonna find the plugins button and we're just gonna click on install plugins. Left click on that. After that, it's gonna take us to this page right here. We're gonna click on add new plugin right next to plugin. Left click on that. And here on the right hand side, we're gonna search for easy Google fonts. Enter and it should be right here we're gonna click on install now and you're gonna wait for it to install it's usually very 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 short it shouldn't take that long i guess and that's installed after that it's gonna change to activate left click on that and then it's gonna take us to this page right here so what you're gonna do is you are gonna click on get started and right next to font controls we're gonna click on manage with live preview and click on leave site so it's gonna take us to this page right here so it's a normal page but right now we are customizing typography so that's our website so you can basically just click on that then click on default typography that's like a default version of your site so what we're gonna do is we are going to basically click on that and in the paragraph let's say we can change text decoration for example which is an underline for example as you can see for example team default you can just say uppercase and we can choose a language even let's say Japanese and we can also change of course our font which is right here so let's say it's ABZ or able and as you can see see it changes right away so when you go back you can basically see all the headings and everything so you can basically change for example heading one let's go to style and just font color let's say it's blue we can change our font star size line height for example and in the position we can basically change margin padding border border radius and display let's go this for example and in the font we can do also uh, text transform which is for example capitalize and that's basically it you can reset it by clicking on reset and you can close it by clicking on close so that's it for today's video um the last thing you wanted to do i forgot you can just click on publish and it's gonna publish on your site so that's it for today's video i hope i guys helped you and i hope i see you in the next one bye